Hello and welcome to episode 18 of our 600 Towns Midlands map. And there's a train pulling out of, can you guess? We're not going to quite play guest station just yet. I keep teasing you with it, but uh, it is Royal Leamington Spa. Or Leamington Spa, I believe the station is called, not Royal Leamington Spa. That's our Chilton... Chilton Railways train leaving the platform. This is going to get very busy. Especially once we get uh, cross country in too. Alright, busy day today. Uh, we've got some new services to put on. We've got a service to correct. Which is why we're here. We've also got to finish off uh, from Tisley to, I believe we got to Danzy. Need to finish that off. And if we do, there's another train coming. Look at that. Hopefully it's the one we want. I don't think it is, though. It looks like another... Uh, I can't see him. It looks like another... Chilton Trains! Or Chilton Railways Train. There we go. I'll get it right one day. But let's turn things on and get on with it, because it's a bit busy. It was a mixed reception, uh, my mass... <laughs> my mass station laying. So apologies for those who, who enjoy the scenery work. We will get back to that. Which leads me nicely to uh, the castle off I mentioned with myself and Bumbling Brit. Bumbling Brit and myself, if I'm being polite. On Sunday, we are going to be attempting Warwick Castle. I need to uh, thank, I don't know how to pronounce your name, but I'll call, 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 <laughs> Christopher. He showed me a, uh, a station video at Leamington Spa and these... They are not purple. They're a different colour. They are the they are West Midlands Railways. But they're not purple. They are quite a garish green, believe it or not. We'll see how this goes. It's about the right green. It's almost GWR again. Look at that. So that's kind of the green we're going for. Look at it, little tank wagon. Off he goes to Coventry via Kenilworth. Okay, I've done a little bit. I fixed our uh, our motorway heading up there. The A46, perhaps. I think it's the A46. I think it's the A46 all the way up to here. Then you'll see I've uh, it turns into the A45 here. And I'm not sure where the A45 goes after that point. It's a bit of a mess of a junction. But we're going this way. I've done some terraforming around Coventry. I'm preparing to do something interesting. You might guess what that is. This is either going to go very well or very terribly. I also uh, just quickly need to thank Golden Golden Squid, Roly, Roly Povey and MJSC for their timetable. They've been helping out in Discord. I knew this would happen. Let's hope in the thank you patch that there's a way to stop motor. We, we might as well just not. <laughs> just just deal with it. It's just going to forever be like that, isn't it? I mean, we could keep doing this, though. But, I mean, they're just going to keep turning it into roads. That that was a great road right there. Right. I forgot to point something out last episode. We need to head back over here quickly. Here we go. There's a crossover here. I want to thank Multiplio for pointing that out. I didn't see it on the map, and it's not shown on the rail map that I use either. Very, very interesting. I don't know whether it's used or not. We did all this. A look at the people waiting. This will be uh, interesting for Guest the Station. I'll make sure that you can see this. Just remember, it's not Horton and Ribblesdale. It is Wilmcote. It could be a different station, actually. We might... Put some more in. And that will really confuse you. I saw some pictures. Uh, someone sent some pictures in. Might have been Dan B. No, it was a video. Yeah, Dan B showed, us, showed me a video. A link to a video in the, the description. The description. In the comments below the last episode. I am tripping over myself today. I do apologise. And do you know what? This is a good job. This is a good job. I love this station. I'm not going to... Yustel, Dristel, I'm not even going to attempt your name. 
<laughs> I just did, but I butchered it. Right. Anyway, here is our M road coming to... They've stopped doing it. That's interesting. They have stopped upgrading. Maybe there is a way we can get away with that. We might be, how, be able to stop them. Perhaps if we provide them more places to build, they'll stop upgrading these. I put the junction in. This is the M40 just here. And then you've got the M42. And then it changes to the M42 that way. And that is exactly how you uh, connect to a motorway. It's not, is it? Multiplio. He is a lifesaver. He pointed me. I didn't know this is what this was for. But I'm going to show you guys. Uh, make sure all that's off. This. You may have seen these on the workshop. It's the measuring set uh, by BR146. And if you click on these and click, say, 100 meters. Here's the cool thing. Place this down. Remember we used to use the road trick? We're not using it for measurements, but if you line your camera up like that, that is facing north. This will always face north, providing you don't uh, use M and N to rotate it. Uh, you can re rotate other things. <laughs> Look at them changing the road over. We'll sort that out at some point. But that should be facing north now, spot on. If we go to the side... Look, we're looking north. And if we go up here... Oh, I know, it's a long way. We're facing north. I mean, roughly, it's close enough. But that will... That down there will uh, always face... This this arm here will be north. Uh, the Y axis is facing north. The X axis will always be facing... East. So there we go, isn't that? And that's facing up, obviously. <laughs> Well, that's beautiful. And to get rid of it, you just uh, delete that. There's some measuring tools and things, which are kind of cool. We should get on with this, shouldn't we? I still haven't. I still haven't started. Let's do it. Let's let's get some track down. We need to do uh, wood end. That's the station. It's going to be about here. We're going to have to juggle it around a bit. And we need a tunnel there. So hopefully, we're going to have to go a lot tighter than what it is too. Hopefully, we can cut not with ballast. Hopefully we can come down a bit. Oh, look what we've got. Catenary. Already. Well, we don't need it yet. But that's good news. Maybe we can electrify some areas that would indeed be electric. Oh, that's uh, that's interesting. Maybe we, if we do that early on. I don't believe this is. I believe these are all diesels. We're going to have to uh, curve quite aggressively compared to real life but then the distances are shorter so we don't mind the track being slower and I would like to just go down a touch here so give us some elevation because I want to get wood end tunnel in and then the station is right after it so we're going to we're going to go down to help us not too much though because we'll raise the area before it as I keep going down but we are going under a tunnel look at that we don't want to go under just yet, though. That's perfect. So we'll do that. We'll come round here. This bit is cut the top. There we go. There we go. We'll go there. And there. We have our tunnel in. The, the, the town is actually kind of above us. Then we want to come up afterwards. Just gently. Not too far, because we've got to go under the motorway, too. That's fine. We'll get rid of that and that. Just a touch. We want to come up. I think we've gone too low. That's what I think we've done. Let's take us back a touch. Because we have definitely gone a bit too low there. I don't mind us going low. I just don't want us to go too low. It looks like the height map is right though. which is Which is lovely. There we go. Maybe we're a bit better there. We've got our tunnel. Now, can we come like straight back up while we're in the tunnel and then level out once we get the other side? Would be nice. All right, I think we are going to be able to. That's kind of the right height to go under that motorway too. Why won't that allow us to do that though? 
I know what we need to do, guys. I've got this. I've got this. Wait. Well, we could... The easy way is to do it like this. Because I don't want too much of a tunnel. We do this first. Then we come straight up like so. Don't need it too aggressive. There we go. We are kind of in a... In a valley here, but not quite... Quite that drastic. But we're not leaving much room after that. So maybe we can just go up to the station and straighten. So if we keep straight as we're coming up, now we can get this tunnel right. Yes. Now, let's go up a bit more. We want the tunnel where it is. And then we need to fit the station in. Still going up. And then we'll level out. Still got to go under there, remember. This should be a good place for the station. And what we'll do is once we have this in, we'll delete back, uh, figure out where the station's going and go from there. We're going to have to pull this back anyway. So let's get rid of all of that. Let's get our station in. It's just a normal two platform station. Uh, we're not going to go with that one, that's for sure. We only need one of these. That, we're not having you, so let's, uh, let's pick a, what do we want? Ooh, the, the choices. I kind of want that one. But, uh, he's awkward to get in at the best of times. I kind of like having the, uh, oh, these are cool. Should we try this? At the risk of it all crashing. Oh, I'm nervous. In the name of science, I have saved it. I've got a frog in my throat today. We're going to put it going round that way. Heading to slightly to Earl's. Like so. And then we're going to delete here and there. And what I want to do I mean, it's going up a bit steep. We'll uh, tidy this up a touch. I would like you to go just... If you go there, like that. I think we've got enough room to make that happen. And we'll delete this. This is the length of our station. <laughs> he says. Right. Let's... Um, I don't know how to do this. Group one. How do we do this? Do we rotate him? Okay. Then what do we do? Do we do that? I should have looked up the instructional video, but I didn't. Will that connect us? Uh, now what do we do? Do we just go on here and then do we click that? Oh my word. Is that just going to make it? All right. Then what do we do? Can we do like two tracks? Oh, okay. Let me pause this. I don't want them building any further. This is a bit cool. Should we have done this the other way? Can you rotate this? I, I don't know. I don't know. What's instructions? Tenery, no. Number tracks, two. We don't have any transit tracks. Radius, it should do... We raise the height. I'm a little bit unsure how this is going to go. Roof length, there's none really out here. Platform variation, we don't need. We're, we're doing this together, guys. We're doing this together. It'll be a small one. It hasn't gone the right way round. So... If we change it to right, but we need the see it's to put the track in the wrong place. So if if we go to here and delete this and that, and what we do is we bring this up to here and that up to there. We delete that side and that side, and then we do that again. It should make our thing, right? Should. So we now go with this. 
bear with me. I mean, let, let's learn together. I mean, there's our north and south thing. That's not what we need. And then we do that. I mean, I think I got this bit right for our station. Probably once I get the hang of this, uh, it would be kind of nice to just fit things into sections like this. Oh, but it doesn't remember all the settings. That's a little upsetting. Let's get those back where they were then. Two tracks. Uh, height. Get rid of all of this gubbins. All right, I think we have it. It's the moment of truth where it all just then doesn't work. Build. Uh-oh. Wait. What? That didn't do what I thought it would do. Shouldn't you have done that yourself? What's going on there? Build. I don't know what we're doing here. Oh! Okay. Okay. I, I don't, I'm not sure what I did there, but it kind of works, doesn't it? Do we just get rid of these? I don't know what these are. I mean, I'm still not quite sure what we did there. Right. We'll, we'll don't do that. Where's all of our point? I don't know what's going on. So if we delete this now, all the way into the tunnel, I'm intrigued more than anything. Can we connect up to there on a more of a curve? Are we, have we got it? Because that's kind of cool if we have. Do you know how it kind of works, doesn't it? That's pretty cool. Well, there you go. I mean, I, I messed it up a little bit, but we can go up a touch after our after our station here. I'd rather go straight first. We haven't got any junctions for quite a while yet. Or oh, how happy would you guys be if if it if you can no long the AI will no longer upgrade motorways. They shouldn't anyway. They should leave them alone. I don't know what their problem is. <laughs> I, just, I know. I sound worse than how I really feel about it, to be honest. Let's, uh, let's just go on a gentle slope, shall we? I think we've got enough clearance here. Uh, let's put a bit of extra either side. Which we'll delete shortly. Let's send our motorway over and hope that it all goes according to plan. It kind of doesn't. Oh, oh, it does. Does actually. I don't like that. We need a bit more, uh, we need a bit more space here. So what we should do, where are we heading? Earl's Wood, which is kind of, well, here's the thing. I'm thinking we skip Earl's Wood, which is about there, and instead put in, uh, I think it's called the Lakes, just here. Which is technically closer to Earl's, Earl's Wood. So we'll put the lakes in. It, it's going to be on a corner. And we're going to head up a touch. Not that much. Like there. Because I still want us to kind of be under. Like in a little valley thing. But not quite that bad. Let's give us some more room here. Either side. I've, I've ended up. What I've ended up doing here is experimenting with new things that I've not really looked into. And uh, <laughs> so apologies for that. And I've also managed to uh, get back into the doing things not as quickly sort of phase. All right. So we got that. I would have preferred that to be either side. So can we can we maybe do something here? I don't know. Not really what we want. What we what we could do. Take it back even further. And hopefully it'll get rid of that thing that we've got going on here. Just just so we can get its other leg down. That's all I want. Will that give us enough room for two legs? I hope so. I like the legs. That was some excessive weirdly buildings. No, it's not it's not gonna give us a leg. How far do you want these apart before you want a leg? That doesn't look right, though. <laughs> it doesn't, does it? Uh, maybe we can just kind of do that. No, because I don't know what the angle is. I mean, technically, it doesn't matter, does it? There. Will you do it now, please? Not like that. Like this. Oh, you will. 
All right, we got our legs in. Keep it. I mean, I know there's a lot going on there. It's probably... Actually, looking at it, it's probably not like that at all, is it? You probably just need, like, an arch. We'll take that, though, I think. I think I'll take that. Special episode time. Perhaps no one's uh, tried using that yet, who is watching. And it might have... Uh, Either scared you off completely, because it wasn't the best example, was it? Or, you're, you've got a... You've got an urge to use it yourselves now. I, I think that's kind of cool, though, because th this is probably a very weird-sized station now. And a very interesting curve, to say the very least. I kind of like that idea. I really do. Right, I'm not sure what we're doing with this. We're just going to bring it up gently, I think. And uh, go into town, as it were. Like that. Something different. I'm really hoping that they start to leave uh, the motorway alone. I think the only way you're going to do that is by... Offering them lots of options for building. Now, here's what I kind of like. Uh, we're running out of town, aren't we? I know that much. If we go across like this, without destroying the rest of the village just yet, what I'm hoping is they build on top of there. That's my plan. Whether they will, who knows. But it would be kind of cool. I'd like you to go that way, and then round there, give you an option that side. Then we'll do something kind of similar here, like there, and just go down a little bit along the side. We'll just make some, like, curvy roads, because they're not all straight, are they? Especially in villages. Bit of a corner there, and then you just join on for no apparent reason. Oh, that's quite steep. No, yeah, fine. Elevation is fine. I'm not sure what we're doing with this bit yet, but we'll just leave it. We'll have another one, like, because needless T-junctions are great. Uh, crossroads, sorry. Get it right. Right, let's see how that goes. It's either going to wreck our tunnel or look really cool. Place your bets on that one. Uh, knowing the game, it's going to ruin it. But, you know... Have a little faith. It might not. Let's make that less obvious for now. It's super official, isn't it, today? It's funny, because uh, Dermot Frost mentioned in the comments last episode that uh, he's like, that's more my pace, that is. Not, like, barely a smoothing in sight. So this episode, or today, I decided to do... Uh, Way too much smoothing, I would imagine. Do we do we mind, though? It's kind of relaxing. It is for me. I'm going to need a breather soon, because... I tell you what, these maps are exhausting. And you're probably saying, but Grand, you only do two hours a week on them. No. No, I don't do two hours a week on them. <laughs> I do far more. You wouldn't believe it, but the, uh, the research that goes into it... And the... Which you probably wouldn't believe either, but I do. I do try. And the little bits of scenery I do everywhere, which half the time I forget to show you, but we do get to it eventually. Let's put this station in. This one, I'm uh, a little nervous of doing, or a lot nervous of doing two of those. I don't know whether it will still remember the other stuff. Or when we placed this, did it delete them automatically? I mean, it did a good job. I'm pretty impressed with that, because that is kind of, look at the station, it it goes with the track. Do you know, that is amazing, look at that. That's more like a British station. The more I look at this, I mean, it takes a while to get it in, so I think for future stations where they're, they're kind of not regular, this is beautiful. But what I'm going to have to do there is edit out me messing about, setting it up. Because that, that does take a little while. 
I mean, this fence here, probably not a good idea. Uh, we, he said he updated it with, I don't know what to do here. He said that he updated it and that it had little signposts on. I guess not. Did he get rid of those? I don't know what makes them have signposts. Perhaps they need, oh, I bet they need uh, coverings. You reckon that's what it is? If I put coverings on, at the risk of it crashing. Okay, moment of truth. I'm going to put coverings on and I'll be the guinea pig. Will it crash and will it actually put the little signs up? Where are the coverings? What's length ratio? I've never seen that before. What's that? Oh, because it's a special planar one. All right. I mean, I'm down with that. So if we put a roof on it, what's it going to put on there? Is it just going to crash? Oh, I'm so nervous right now. It didn't. Okay. But what have you done? Do I now have to build this? No, it's not broken. I just don't think it's doing much. I think I'm... I almost broke that. We'll try another one with like a little covering on it. But uh, yeah, I might have broke that. Do we want to do the same here then? Or, or should we do something different? We need a curved station. I mean, Great Lakes to... Not Great Lakes. <laughs> the Lakes. Sounds like just like a, a little countryside station. Do you know, we're, we're halfway through. That is crazy sauce. Yeah, we don't want that. No. Thank you. Uh, I don't know why it doesn't put the... Let me put the uh, these on. I don't know how to get the little signposts up. He, he said they put signposts up, but I, I'm not sure how that happens. I'm going to guess you might need the roof on, but uh, possibly. We could test it with this one, right? Let's test it. Come on, because what's the point of being a YouTuber if you don't help out people who are watching you? So if we go something like that, and we need to be on this outside track, I think. If we do something like that, and then we go and put our little bit there, and we delete all this... Not that. And then we go back to this. And then we go to our little planner. Uh, let's knock that back because the game just doesn't like those at all. We put that one there. That one there. Then we'll go to this. Right. Preview. This is all in the name of science and not what I had planned. This time, uh, we want two tracks. Please be on the right side. Are you going to be on the other side? You, <laughs> why? Why Why would you be on the other side this time? Oh, why did you do that? You were on the right side last time. I don't know what the, uh, the question mark's for, to be honest. So if we do this. Right, now it's on the right side. No, now it's on the wrong side clear we want we want to be on the other side don't we are we clearing clear oh whatever just stay there then we want to get rid of all of this then those okay we're going on this side now guys I'm not sure what constitutes the side it chooses. I guess we'll, we'll never know. He may tell us. Should we try again? Let's try again. I don't know. I probably... I'm, I'm risking breaking this because I'm not using this efficiently at all. But I do want to do it for you guys. I don't know what the uh, question mark's for. I mean, I understand these arrow things, but the uh, question mark is is confusing. I mean, I love it. Don't get me... Oh, it's done it on the other side now. You... Why? Why? Is it the order you put these in? Is that perhaps it? Is it the order you put them in? 
can't remember which order I put them in last time. I, wa I Now, I did watch his video briefly. And uh, I was uh, confused after watching it. So, apologies. <laughs> I, I don't think it's his fault. Okay, try again. Yes, because that building is on that side. All right, perhaps it's the order you put these in. I'll take that if that's the case. Let's, uh, this time, we'll put uh, a roof on. A bit more width. I do like this. It's a bit snazzy, isn't it? Uh, planar positions. I just wish I knew how to get those uh, little signposts on, because I'm not sure. What I want to do is call this the lakes. We got everything, right? That's everything we need. Maybe 50%. I would like to uh, flip, make that small, put it on the right, get rid of all the rest. This, by the way, Urban Games, is how we should be able to, but obviously, explain it a bit, a bit more, how how we do the, uh, the things, the stations, because it's kind of cool. He's got the right idea, but I, I feel like he's making the game do stuff, do things it should not be doing build that's not what you're supposed to do that's not what you're supposed to do at all i don't know quite know how it works yeah there we go there we go it built it and after all that it didn't put the signs in yes it did but it called called it earlswood i mean that's a start right Wow, that makes guess the station a bit. E Look at that. You do indeed need the uh, roof things on. But if you have them on. Oh, wow. That is amazing. That is amazing. How did he do that? That is crazy, guys. Look at this. I mean, I'm keeping that in just because it... I mean, it says the wrong name. That's a little unfortunate. But, uh, yeah. I mean, I don't know whether if you update it, it will uh, do it again. I mean, okay. I mean, we'll call it the lakes, but we can put Earlswood in there. Oh, do you know? I've put that on the wrong side. I'm going to go away and I'm going to rebuild this and name it correctly. So after a couple of crashes, I mean, it's to be expected because I don't know what I'm doing with it. Doesn't it look all right? What I've decided is the lakes is actually the tiniest station in the world. It's adorable, but we're going to, we, I wanted to kind of combine the two. Earlswood would be like here. So we combined the two but called it the lakes because it's where the lakes is. Even though it's a combination of the two. I will get the hang of this. I promise. And th this is a very short stopping uh, area. It's probably a bit too long. But considering it's two stations combined, why not? Plus, guess the station, guys. That's going to be a bit of a... <laughs> a bit of an easy one, isn't it? That's just going to be first come, first served. On to uh, Withal, then, which is going to be uh, a little bit different, as in we're not going to mess around too much with that one, so don't worry. I, I just want to use that all the time now. Wouldn't it be cool, though, if we could uh, do that to any station we liked with the name on and stuff? It'd be amazing. Let's put uh, Withal on. With Withal in. Which is uh, going to be a little... A little more basic. In fact, uh, I would have it as this one, to be honest. But uh, we, we can't have the curve on it, unfortunately. Uh, there's always the plus station, which is kind of nice. But uh, it's three tracks minimum, which doesn't help us. It's a nice station, but it's I guess it's for more... For the bigger stations, we could probably find places for this. It's interesting we have a uh, catenary already. We could go advanced. That that kind of works. 
uh, put a bit of a curve on it. It is curved, but not by much. Yeah, it's kind of like that. I do kind of like that. Sort of. Uh, I think it's a bit excessive for what we're doing. There we go. That's it. That's all we need for that. That's with all. We're going to put it down here. Hooked onto there. Straight away. No, we're not. Because we need to be down a bit, don't we? Think about it, sir. Let's keep us down in the ground a bit. We'll come round. We can slope up to the uh, to the town. It's just kind of a crazy area around here. Okay, we just need one. Now that looks about right to me. And then we can make that curve. This town's about wrecked now. Apologies for anybody that lives there. We'll bring this up. Until we're kind of level. So we could just do that really. There we go. Then we'll go from here. Kind of like that. I just... Don't like this bit. I mean we're just going to have to get rid of that aren't we? I promise I will sort those out. At another, uh, another date. I don't know how we're going to get down here. This is taking way longer than I thought it would. I think the only thing I can do is finish this off uh, later on, ready for next episode. Because I, I wasn't really expecting to play with these, let's face it. That was my fault. I do apologise. But we did find something cool. Uh, we've still got some time though. We can maybe fit a few more in. We need to be heading, um, oddly, the other side of of Hollywood. We have Hollywood. Of course we do. You, you didn't know that Hollywood was in fact... Uh, where are we right now anyway? I don't even know. I know we're near Birmingham, but what's the county? So we're going to have to come around pretty sharp out here. I know it's slow, but it kind of makes sense than being like really close together, but really slow. Reminds me of an old old branch lines. We're going to go up here. See, I don't know whether we're going to fit both of these in. I want to. We can make it work, right? This sort of thing with branch lines and short stops is definitely a thing. I mean, they're not too... Well, they are. These two are close. But this one was worth it. And that one kind of was. No, I don't like that. Maybe what we should do... Right. This would make quite a bit more sense. Is connect these station to station. And that... Would look like someone actually planned to do that. That's better. Look at that. That's beautiful. Alright, get on with it, Brand. You're messing about. Right, are we looking north? I've got no idea. Should we find out? <laughs> I love this new tool. I really do. It's pretty amazing. Let's get it out and uh, plonk it down. Then we can see where north is. We are now looking north. Brilliant. So if that's north, we need to be... Uh, we kind of want one station here. And we definitely need this one... Ah, right, yes. Wittock's End. This is going to be Wittock's End. And Shirley's up here. Uh, we definitely need those in. As they have uh, turnarounds after them. We're a bit close. I want to uh, do similar curve, but going this way. Definitely. Right, let's bring this up a bit. I think we're going to run out of room slightly. But... Uh, I don't know how this is going to work. So we've got Wittick's End there, and, and and it literally is, round the corner, is Shirley's End. Uh, Shirley's End. <laughs> this is Wittick's End. Right, let's, let's name this correctly. I don't... I think it's that, Wittick's End. Let me check. Ah, not, not Wittick. Yes, I'm glad I actually looked that... Because it is Whitlock. I was kind of right. Look at that. Whitlock's end. 
that has a turnaround just here. Obviously, I've forgotten how to do turnarounds, uh, crossovers. I have a feeling we've got some serious terraforming to do, or I have in between episodes. That's Whitlock's End, which is a thing, and it's pretty much how it goes. Let's have a nice little path going up to there. Although that person who just lost his house is probably not impressed with my pathing. It's fine. You, AI, make a mess of my roads, so I think we're even. Surely we can fit this in. I'm at it again. It's like barely down there, isn't it? So Shirley is on the corner. And I think it's actually quite a bit more aggressive than Whitlock. Whitlock, sorry. Is this on the straight and narrow? I think it is. Go there. We'll put that in there. Actually, we might need to flip that round a little bit. Connect that up. This has another turnaround. Then we're going up to... Uh, now, Yardley... Here's the thing. Yardley Wood is actually further north than Yardley. Not that north, though. But uh, we've kind of run out of room. We'll make it work. We're, we're almost there, you see. We're almost there. Whether we're going to get Hall Green in... We might, we might have to miss one of these. There is a sidings here, which is why I'm flattening this out. All right, so far so good. Sort of. My plans are kind of messed up. I think I decided this is where Hall Green was going to be. Um, we're we're not having. We're not having the the one here. I can't remember what it's called. I do apologize. Um, you are all going to have to go. Thanks for building. It was amazing. Oh, it's Hall Green. Look at that. I didn't like what you were doing there anyway, to be perfectly honest with you. I do think we need to come down from here and not go up any further. But we have the yard. That's awkward. This yard is going to be a bit of a squeeze, isn't it? We'll go round there. I'm not sure which way the crossover is there, so I'll look that up before I put it in. The uh, sidings is kind of there. Right, so if that's Yardley, they're going to be close. I mean, we do do them close anyway. So perhaps, perhaps we can do that. If we do that there, how are we looking? If we do that there, that's Yardley Wood. Yes. And if we do this one here, uh, curving the other way, like that, as whole green, they're, they're, they're on a bit of a slope problem, aren't they? Perhaps we need to uh, bring these down, since they're all the same station, technically. Perhaps we need to head down sooner. That's what I'm thinking. So I'll do that for us. Let's get right down there, like pretty much off the bat. I'm liking this better. We're at a kind of better angle. I don't know whether we're at the right angle. We are so close. This is the problem with scale. It's like, do we do we dump one or not? I don't know. I really don't know. Yeah, we are s silly close there. I think Hall Green is going to bite the dust, and that works out for us. Sorry, Hall Green. Or, we could perhaps move Hall Green back closer to here. Although now it's miles away, and it's more like the other one. That's, that's sad. Back you up a bit. We will get this, I promise. And then we've got it in, and then you know what we do. Back you up right there. We'll just send you back down. As steep as possible. And as soon as possible. We could maybe make it wiggle a bit more. If we go out that way first. It's not going to be the best. We could make this station slightly smaller. Because it's only small trains that run here. That's an idea. 
Let's make them 140 instead. Slightly smaller. We could do that for all of them, really. Yeah, what am I thinking about? We could, uh, I mean, we could technically get away with 100, but that's further back because we're, we're curving more. Making these 140 might might about do it for us. I, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of liking that better. That's all these need. There are only three cars. These are probably way too long as well. It's like very tempting to make them hundreds, to be honest. Do you know what, guys? I'll leave that one up to you. Would you like them, uh, considering what sort of route this is, would you like to see them change to 100? It wouldn't take long for me to do it. So. I don't mind. It may look a little better in the long run. Yeah, you see, that's already given us a bit more track between each one. We'll do that. That works. You stay in flat. Which one's this? Shirley, right? We've probably lost the, the naming. Yeah, that's not what that is. Shirley. This is going a little better. Don't worry, we'll, we'll sort all of this mess out. Right, how much is that route? There's enough room for a little sidings there. And we're quite a way back, and we've got a shorter platform. So if we put that there instead... Yes, this is possible. This is kind of possible. I think we might have got away with it because I didn't really want to get rid of whole green. So, and then we'll come around this way. It's all wiggly, like all over the place. We'll come around here. How are we looking? All green is just there. That kind of works. This is looking better. Then it can be roughly where I want it now. Which will be there. You going in that way round. Switch that round like that. We might have to put other platforms on. The question is, how does that look? I think we nailed it. What do you think, guys? I don't think that looks... Well, it looks terrible. And what, I'm, what I meant to say was... I don't think we did too bad... Given uh, the amount of room we had there. We'll just take the edge off these. We want that on low, really. Just to smooth around the edges. We'll bring that down. We'll probably bring that back up eventually. We'll kind of do this. To give it back its uh, embankment. And then smooth it. Closer to the track. As long as it's kind of that high. Don't know what we're doing with the stations. We will make them uh, look a lot better, I promise. I feel like I've done a lot of tracking and, and not a lot of uh, detailing lately. Although, no, we've done quite a bit of detailing today. In the fact, we've done a lot of learning, or I've done a lot of learning. Or maybe not, because I'm still a bit clumsy with it. We're going to connect this straight up. Uh, I don't know where you're going. There are some bridges around here, so that kind of works. Before we end, we'll hook up a new service, which is going to service all of these stations. You're just going to go there for now. Because I don't know what we're doing with you, to be honest. Just yet. We'll make it work. I What I really wanted to do for the next part of our progression is have placeholder. These might not go quite like this. There is a beautiful like little, uh, looks like an old, uh, what do you call them? Multi-story multi -story car parks just here. If I would like to kind of recreate that. I'm not sure how to do it. We should be able to just use our building blocks over the top. I don't know. We'll see. Even if we just put something there, but it would be like a little tunnel thing. Man-made by us, or handmade I should say uh, you can just for now join up to there maybe and also to there just to get us going it's placeholders remember that this is our, uh, as I was saying at the very beginning you remember it was kind of a bit meh to start with I wouldn't have noticed that that's because a lot of the time, what we were doing 
is setting up how we were going to be moving forward by drawing outlines. That's what this is, but it's a huge outline. We do have this in. This is a thing that exists. And we and obviously I'm going to show us this again because it I had to do get through two crashes that took forever to get back. The lakes. I love this. Even though this is technically two stations in one. Uh, because there was no way we're fitting in Ellswood actually there. So there we go, guys. We have connected up to Tisley. And it, it's not bad. Once this is uh, once I've terraformed this and got we've got the bushes in and stuff. And a few bridges. I think we'll 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 like that. Shall we put what what station is that? Shirley, good. Yardley Wood, brilliant. All green, please. Yes. Let's make a new line, shall we? This is going to be our. I think these are green. They're, they're kind of green and white. I'm going to go with uh, it. The weird thing is, it's kind of like uh, London Northwestern, that kind of colour. No, actually, it might be closer to that kind of colour. But here we go. We're going all the way. This is going to stop at, like, a, so many stops. It really is. But we don't mind. We're just going to keep going like this. This is it. It's a, it's a commuter run. It comes in here. This will be using this correctly. We're going to stop here too. Then we're stopping there. And then we're finally turning around up there. And then making our way back. Like so. There we go. Then we're heading this way. Look at all the stops. Now this is probably like three services combined. Two or three at least. Because they kind of alternate and they don't always stop at them. Uh, we might be able to split it into two at some point and have one frequent stopping, but given we can't timetable, that might be a problem. There we go. I kind of like that. Where's our other one stopping? We also need our Chilton train that's coming down here. As I don't know where that stops, that's something we can look at all the money. Yeah, we're making loads of money there. That's a bit worrying why that's showing a balance. Because <laughs> I'm supposed to have the no cost mods on. I'm kind of a little worried that I don't have it on anymore. Anyway, this is, uh, we'll call this Stratford Ponhaven to Birmingham. No, Snow Hill. There we go. Brilliant. It's in. Should we get some trains on? We're going to need a lot of trains. How many should we run on here? I don't know. I think... I think... Ooh, six. Should we do six? I mean, they're not, they're not moving very quick. We'll see if that's too many. Let's pick us a train. Finally. Finally, Grand. You're finally picking a train. Yes, let's upgrade the depot. That's not... That's not what I want to do at all. Locomotives. Let's pick us a nice... Nice new train. Do you know, I think we kind of want this A3. I, I I almost want that A3. Oh, what have we got there? The Atlantic GNR. What's that, Great Northern? Ooh. Well, this isn't good for a branch line. However, this bad boy, I think... I think that should run our... Uh, Cross country line when we put that in. That's what we're going to use that Atlantic for. For now. Is this one of our new ones? I feel like it is. I, I don't think we actually, actually run the, a Bulldog class. I bet these are not used for uh, um, passenger service. They are. <laughs> look, at the, look at the description, Grand. Mainly used for passenger services. Brilliant. So you are going to be... Well, there's going to be a lot of you. you. So I hope you're nice. You're going to be this green. Kind of a, a lighter green. We're going to buy you. What wagons do we have on here? 
I don't have the no cost mod on, do I? I just noticed. Can we afford these? <laughs> this is absolutely awkward. Can we afford all of these? I guess I want to run these. We might we might run out of cash though. But I don't want to go broke. Oh, that is terrible news. Okay. Scrub that idea. Let's save it. I need to uh, put the no cost mod back on. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Right, we're back to finish off <laughs> with our trains. Well, I, I duplicated one just to make sure that I... The, I found the problem. The no cost mod. This is this is definitely an interesting one. If it's uh, If you have the auto balance... After the no cost mod, it turns on costs again. So it's a good idea to have the no cost mod last. In fact, I don't know why I have the other one. Right, let's get our trains. Notice we're not spending money. Now, our money should go back up. I don't know how long we're running with that on, actually. That's an interesting one. So how many we got? That's five. I uh, want to clone one more. Set line all. This is probably the least best way to do this. Stratford upon Avon. Here come a monstrous amount of trains to end the episode. A, a little bit of a different one. We learned how to use a new station. Well, it's I mean, it's still the ultimate station, but in a different way. These, these we might make a, a, a coach longer. We'll see how they perform. At least it's a new train. We haven't had a look at it, have we? Let's get at the end here, near this guy's car. So you can come by. Lovely. I like that. They're our little... Uh, what would they be? West Midlands trains, but in green and white. Which is kind of close. Look at that. If this wasn't a cream colour and was white instead, that wouldn't be far off. I believe they've got some black down the siding too. Like a black stripe. I would love to take some time on one of my maps. And uh, kind of put liveries on these how they would look if they were modern like say the the uh, West Midlands Railway livery but designed on an old train like on the old coaches and stuff be just interesting to see I mean you'd have to be a little artistic license on there so they're all coming out it, uh, our tracks gonna get a lot busier I'm kind of happy where we've gone with this. I'm super happy with this up here. Where is it? Where's our lakes? Where's our lakes? Earlswood in the lakes. Isn't that beautiful? I absolutely love that. Wish there was a way for that to happen. Like on any station. So that you could have this sort of thing going on. That is a wonderful job, by the way. The guy is doing a marvellous job with this. It crashing, not really his fault. I was doing some crazy stuff. I will sort out this siding. We'll probably put that in. But uh, coming Sunday, we're going to do Warwick Castle. Hope you're looking forward to that. Uh, Fridays are for Bumbling Brit. If you go and check his channel out, he should be doing Pembroke, Cash Penbrook Castle. I hope he can pronounce it better than I just did. <laughs> So you'll be able to see his first. I won't have seen his because I'll be recording mine before his is due to go out. But yes, Warwick Castle coming here soon to a, a GT channel near you. That, that'll be mine. Right, because that's the only one I know. I will look up what the Chilton Railways train service is here. We don't need these anymore, do we? No, because we can use that cool little uh, measurement thing. Let's end this. I'm kind of happy with how that went. It was a bit different than I had planned, but I got distracted by shiny stations. But that's all right. That's how things happen sometimes. I know this all looks cool and this doesn't, but we're going to have some fun detailing that and take our time and relax. Depending on how long it takes me to do that castle, we might do some of that on Sunday. This is not a good thing, is it? What's going on there? I knew it. I knew it. You're going to have to reverse. Glad I saw that. This needs to go. You can't wait there, which is unfortunate, which means you're going to hold up the main line. That's a little unfortunate. 
I don't know how we can rectify that. We might have to uh, finagle that a little bit. But anyway, distract again. That should work now. Let's hide that. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. We are very close to a thousand subscribers. It is amazing. I'm a little bit excited for that. I've kind of got something planned. Probably be a live stream. Just so you know, if we do reach a thousand uh, anytime soon. We're about 63 away when I recorded this. Thank you everyone who's subbing and those who are, uh, are staying with me. Very much appreciated. Until next time, take care.